This educational video will explain the normal process of digestion, the Ruin Y gastric bypass procedure, and how weight loss will occur upon completion of the surgery. Currently, your stomach can hold about 40 ounces of food. Once in your stomach, the food combines with digestive juices containing acids and enzymes that help break it down into smaller particles. Once broken down, the small particles are slowly released into the first part of your small intestine, the duodenum, by a muscle called the pyloric valve. The pyloric valve is a ring of muscle between your stomach and your duodenum. Most of the nutrients from the broken down food are absorbed in the duodenum and the jejunum, which is the second part of the small intestine. The steps in the Ruin Y gastric bypass involve dividing your stomach into two sections to create a smaller stomach pouch, dividing your jejunum into two sections, creating a Y connection between both parts of your jejunum, and creating a connection between your stomach pouch and jejunum. Your surgeon starts by using an endoscopic stapler and divides your current stomach about one to two inches below the area where your esophagus connects to your stomach. The smaller upper section of the stomach that is connected to the esophagus is your new stomach, also known as the gastric pouch. This gastric pouch will hold about two ounces of food. Next, your surgeon divides and seals your jejunum into two sections. Your surgeon will take the shorter part of your jejunum and reconnect it to the longer part of your jejunum at a point further below the point of division. Next, the remaining part of your jejunum is pulled up and attached to your gastric pouch. Food will now go from your new stomach pouch directly into your jejunum. Prior to surgery, food went from your stomach into your duodenum. Your duodenum and a small part of your jejunum are now bypassed and will not come into contact with any food. Because food bypasses the duodenum and part of the jejunum, fewer calories are absorbed. 